In this video, we will create a Python program that uses a function to simulate the roll of two dice. So let's get started. To begin with, I'm going to find a function, and I can call this roll dice, that will have two variables. Uh, and that will be die A and die B. And this will be used to simulate uh, the rolling of these two die. Um, but I need a way to generate a, uh, a random number um, that goes from one to six, uh, a standard die. And to do that, uh, in Python, I can import the random module. So now this random module has a function called randint that I'm going to use. So I can say die A equals random, so I'm calling the random module, and then randint. And I'm going to pass in uh, one comma sits. As you can see by this little pop-up window here, uh, this function returns a random integer in the range provided, including both endpoints. So one comma sits, that's just a standard die roll. I'm going to do the same thing again for uh, my die b. So random.randint one comma sits. So now I can just print these. So I say print die oop, die one, and then die a. And then the same thing for die b, die 2, die b. So now I just want to return the total. So I just say return die a plus die b. All right, so that's that, that function done. Uh, but now I just need a way to continually ask the user if they like to roll the dice or not. And to do that, I'm going to use a while true loop. And then I'll say answer, this answer variable, I said equal to uh, the input function in Python, and then I'll pass in a prompt, I'll say roll dice, yes or no. Okay, so uh, this input function will give me a string, and so I've saved it in this answer variable, so now I can just compare it. So I say if answer, and I'm going to make it lowercase, just in case uh, a user uh, puts in a capital Y, because I want to compare it strictly to a lowercase y. So if answer dot lowercase equals lowercase y, then I want to roll the dice. And so I can say print total comma roll dice. And so this will call the function, it will give me a die A, it will print that, give me a die B, print that, and then it will return this die A plus die B, and so it will be the total that's displayed right here. But what if somebody inputs um, the letter N instead? So I need to check that as well. So I say else if answer dot lower equals equals N, then I just want to end the loop and end the program. And if somebody um, uh, enters something besides a Y or an N, then it's just going to ask them again. So let's try running it. All right, so it asks us to roll the dice, and we'll say yes. And so we get one, two, and our total is three, so we can try it again. And we get four and one, which is five. And let me put in some junk here. And as you can see, it just asks me the question again. But if I put in no, and I can even put a capital N, then it will end the program. All right, that's pretty much it. Hopefully this was helpful. If you have a prompt you'd like me to try, please leave them in the comments below. Otherwise, thank you for your time.